It's your girl Gladys. Welcome back to the channel. I create hair, fashion, and lifestyle content that'll encourage you to be your very best self. So if you're with that, you're in the right place. Today's Twin Owl Tuesday. Twin Owl Tuesday is a special time on my channel where I showcase super cute hair, fashion finds, the Twin Owl price range, and below. We have a good one today, y'all. We have two half wigs, one of which that I'm wearing right now, and do you see me? Like... <laughs> They need to take me out because, honey, your girl's looking good. I absolutely love this. The texture, the barrel curls, the length. It's giving glamour. It's giving posh. It's giving, like, money. I'm looking like a bag. <laughs> And I'm here for it. So I just wanted to use this video to show you, first of all, how I styled this wig. And also the second wig that I have. Both of these units are sensational units. IWD3 and 4. I've had this one for a while, but I just haven't got a chance to wear it. And then IWD4 I actually purchased from Amazon. My links will be in the description box if you're interested in either of them. And of course, you know I'm an Amazon affiliate, so when you shop for my links, you support your girl. So thank you if you decide to do so. You can also find this on other wig websites. It's up to you where you choose to shop. But I just wanted to let y'all know that I absolutely am in love with this. I have already decided that I'm wearing this this week because I have a gala to go to with C. I was trying to think like, huh, I need like a fancier updo and this is giving what I need. <laughs> started doing outfits of the day on TikTok. Make sure you follow me on there. We're at 7,000 followers, so we're trying to make our way to 10K. So if you want to see what I end up looking like on Friday, I feel like I'm going to be looking like a whole meal, so make sure you check me out on TikTok because they get to see it first. Also, thank y'all for supporting my vlog that I put out recently about my time at Hedonism 2, which is a clothing optional resort in Jamaica. Part 2 is dropping this week as well on Saturday, so stay tuned for that. If you're interested and ready to see how I style this hair and the other half wig, keep on watching. So here I just took out my set of braids in the front and I'm just spraying some heat protectant because you know, we gotta protect my natural strands. And I'm using my new blow dryer brush, which is the Infinity Pro by Con Air. Really loving this brush, y'all. I cannot recommend it enough. You know, Revlon is normally my go-to, but this one is my new go-to and it's $20, $26. So it's a little cheaper than Revlon. So I'm just trying to brush this out here. I did grab my favorite detangler brush also to continue brushing out that part, and that's the travel size one. Everything you see in this video will be linked in my storefront, by the way, in my description box. So this straightener by Timo, T-Y-M-O, it's a great straightener, but please ignore my ratchet ass ends. Oh my goodness, I need to trim so badly, or else it would definitely look a little bit better. But it's getting my hair straight. I think I had it on 390 right here, and I did two passes, and I was like, okay, that's cool. That's good enough for me. Not really big on putting heat on my hair, but you know, for this type of style, I gotta do what I do. One thing I don't like is that I did have some breakage here on my sides and that's back when I used to wear combs a lot more regularly and it just hasn't fully grown out probably because I haven't tried to grow it out. But anyway, here is the star of the show, Sensational IWD3. I got my wig grip on which is what I use when I want to make sure my wig does not fall off because we're not trying to be embarrassed out in these streets. I did tie up the wig, like just tighten it a little bit. I have a medium sized head, 22.3 circumference. And literally, y'all, it was like love at first sight. As soon as I put this bad boy on, I'm just in awe of the unit. I'm absolutely in love with these barrel curls. And you'll see, I actually tried this on before in one of my headband wig videos. I'll link it in my description box. Here, I'm going in with my favorite edge control just to smooth up the ends here. And I'm just tying it up in a half up, half down style. I think you can't go wrong with this type of style. It just automatically gives glam. It's like... Wow, ta-da, I'm here, you know? So once I was done, honey, look at look at the end results. Once I got them lashes on, it's a wrap. You can't tell me nothing. Are you kidding me? Was this really, is this really a $20 wig? $20? I know y'all love to talk about tapings and sew-ins, but honey, get you a half wig. Where have you been? So after I was done like taking pictures and looking at myself, I was like, you know what? I don't want to stop. <laughs> 
<laughs> no, seriously, I decided to take it off and try on the second half wig, which is also sensational. It's the IWD4 unit. I wanted to get the number four color because, first of all, it was $17 on Amazon. And also, I wanted to showcase the four because I know I normally do not. I am wearing this wig with a headband, which this is like my new favorite headband. I also bought this from Amazon, and I'll link everything down below. But yeah, I'm just putting my wig cap back on secure make sure everything's good and one thing about this wig i noticed that it's three combs in the front and one in the back versus the other wig was only two combs in the front first thought when putting this wig on was like wow why didn't i get this in a natural color like a number two natural color or 1b why didn't i get this because this slays a beautiful gorgeous yaki texture the main difference is the fact that the IWD3 wig, the longer wig, is actually like a kinky straight texture, whereas this wig is more like a smooth, yakky, almost like your hair has been pressed out a bit. It feels amazing. I tried to do some little flip over action here, and it looked pretty cute, but I pr actually prefer it in the middle. Y'all let me know what y'all thoughts are. But honey, get into these half wigs this fall season. I'm telling you, you cannot go wrong. Sometimes I wonder if y'all will ever get tired of me talking about headband wigs and half wigs. I just hope not because it will always be the ease and convenience for me. This style took me no time. I just plopped it on my head and I'm out the door. Do you see how good this looks? Come on now, y'all. This is definitely date night hair, brunch hair, you know, stunt on your ex type of hair. I'm going out with my girls kind of hair and I'm not coming home till I feel like it kind of hair. Yeah, I'm ready to cash out in this hair right here. I tried to do a little half up half down style just to show you the idea that it could look really cute with the headband. So yeah, I'm here for it. Let me tell you right now, Twenty Dollar Tuesday is on and popping. These half wigs can be purchased for under $20 and I am obsessed. For the texture alone, the curls, the style, the ease, the convenience. Normally I do like to wear headband wigs with my half wigs, but you know, we doing something a little different for the fall season. I decided to let my hair out, and I'm happy with it. I do think the color match is great, and if you're a number four girl, I hope that last half wig does it for you too, because that is a true number four. I'm in love, y'all. Are we here for the half wigs this season? Please let me know. Sound off your comments down below. And if you're new here, subscribe to your girl. Come join the family. We are definitely on our way to 40,000 subscribers, and I'm so freaking excited. Also, y'all, I am going to be back on Amazon Live. I know I took a break from that, but I'm coming back and I really need to figure out what's going to be my new consistent thing with it. I think I should do it bi-weekly. Let me know. Also, speaking of going live, I miss going live on YouTube. It's been a minute. So I got to get back to y'all on that. But I'm thinking it might be either a Sunday night or a Monday night. If I do a Monday night, would it be like 7 p.m., 8 p.m.? Would that be a good time for y'all to join me in like chit chat? And I want to showcase upcoming fashion finds, things like that. Let me know. Speaking of fashion, I do have a fashion haul dropping. Uh, I'm excited. <laughs> it's going to be from Amazon because I've been shopping on there like crazy. And I found some good stuff. So I'm excited for y'all to see it. You can also check out my latest videos over here to the right of me. Thank you so much for joining me today for $20 Tuesday. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.